Hey, Tasha. Hey, Jim. Hey, what did you do last night? I don't know. I think I just went home, cooked some dinner, and went to bed. Me? Had a really good time. Went to a club last night. So listen, I want to ask you, uh, what do you think about maybe us having a drink or a Waffle House waffle? Are you asking me out on a date? Yeah. Oh my god, that's adorable. Yeah, well I think you're cute too. That's why I'm always looming and lingering in your office a little too long. Not stalking, but finding out where you're going to be late at night and then showing up without you knowing. Well, I appreciate the offer, but as far as attractiveness goes, mm -hmm. um, I am going to be right here okay. with Michael B. Jordan. Okay, you're up there. You are right here. Okay, I'm there. Then you raised the roof or did the cabbage patch, so it puts you down right Damn here. Damn it. I knew I shouldn't have raised the roof. I knew I shouldn't have raised the roof. Oh, it's okay. You're still too low. Okay. okay. And I just, sometimes I will date in this area, but it's just too low and it's really weird when I have to explain it to people. Too low. I wouldn't want to do that to you, and I wouldn't want to do that to myself. Thank and you. go too low. Thank, thank you. You're welcome. Oh, 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 Julie! Hey, Julie! <laughs> hey. hey, what are you guys doing? Uh, we were just going over Nothing. the TV. Jim just asked me out on a date. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Did you tell him he was way too low? Why do you guys keep saying that? Um, well, how would you describe yourself? Funny. Charming. Handsome. Wow. <laughs> Zero for three, my friend. Well, the real reason I came in here is because Mr. Walker wants us to let go of Bad Breath Bob. Wait, we're firing Bad Breath Bob? Why? Because of his bad breath. That makes sense. Yeah, three people have quit already, and you're his direct supervisor, so you have to fire him. I guess it's like my father used to always say, life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. That was Forrest Gump. That was only Forrest Gump. Uh, that was my father. I want to thank you for being in here. We do need to have someone in here when we terminate another employee. So I appreciate you as uh, being a witness. So, uh, are you ready for Bob? To come? Go ahead and uh, go ahead and get him in. Hey Bob, we're ready for you, man. Hey Bob. Hey, how you doing? Hey, have a seat. Hey, what's up? Bob, how you what's up, man? How you doing? Yeah. All right. Bob, how's your day been? Hey man, my day's been doing uh, pretty well. I feel like I've been called into the principal's office. But outside of that, hey, I just want to tell you, man, my, I've been doing great with sales. Um, if you look at the reports, no one's doing better than me. I should be the head of this company. Like, at the end of the day, if y'all want to get y'all sales up, y'all need to holler at me. You need to holler at me. You need to holler at me. Put me on. I should be on the other side of the table. I should be on the other side of the table. Y'all just let me know. Just let me know. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling y'all, I'm the man out here. We doing our thing. I'm grinding. I'm grinding out here. Y'all need to get on my level. You feel me? Y'all need to go on my level. All I'm saying is y'all need to go level. Oh, no, no, no. I'm good. I'm good, no, brother. No, I'm no, good. I'm no. good. Bob, you're not good. Bob, you're not good. I'm not good. <laughs> Bob, listen. We need to have a serious discussion. Here we go. We have written you up two times already about your breath, okay? Every morning when you come into the office, what's on your desk? Uh, mints. Mints. Now, who do you think puts those there? It's me, Bob. I do that. I do that to give your breath a jump start in the morning. I put mints on your desk, but do you use them? Bob, listen, are you familiar with those, that company-wide email that we sent out where we were asking people to give suggestions about how we can improve the company, right? Yes. yes. You remember that? Yes. I should be promoted. Listen. That's, yeah. Listen, Bob. Probably would have said. Over 90% of the emails were about you and your breath, okay? okay. Let me, I'll, 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 I'll read some for you. I mean, this is serious stuff here, Bob. To whom it concerns, uh, we need to do something about Bob's breath. In the morning, Bob's breath smells like ass with a hint of cinnamon. Ho, 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 ho. I can explain the cinnamon. But, look, but Bob, though, Bob, let me stop you there. It says a hint of cinnamon. Mm -hmm. 
Okay? That means the majority of your breath smells like the other thing. And the cinnamon not smell good. Listen. I have and, and Bob, I got right I got several. You, do you have more? Make I got I got I got several. I can pick one. Let me just pick one. This is about you. this is actually about your breath in the afternoon. I'll let you, you you can read it. You don't believe me? Bob's breath smell like a shit sandwich with onions. Shit sandwich. Oh, I can explain. With onions. I, I, listen, I can explain the onions. Listen, what do I buy every afternoon? I buy a bag of onions every afternoon. You know this. Now that explains the onion smell. Oh my gosh, man. That's all. So Bob, listen, unfortunately. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Due to your breath. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Due to is, your is, breath. Is this about Tasha? It's uh, about Tasha, right? I knew it. I knew it couldn't be a moment, bro. Hold on a second, hold on a second. <laughs> uh, what does Tasha have to do? Oh, oh you, don't, you don't know? No, no, no. I thought you knew, man. Me and Tasha. You were banging Tasha? Emma. How does your breath not disqualify you from that? <laughs> Ask Derek what he does. Ask him what has he done. I qualify. Let me guess. You're too low. <laughs>